What? What if the Halloween Town had this picture on their pumpkin? What if the Halloween Town had that picture on their pumpkin? Yeah. Then that'd be pretty cool, wouldn't it? Yeah. What do you think of our, our, our handiwork? Cool. <laughs> come here, come here, come here. So, I had to light him up this morning so that he could see him too. Because I didn't get him out here until late last night. So, alrighty. Give everybody a high five. Say, bye guys. Bye guys. Let's get the day started. Dropping him off at school. Well, I'm not making reference to pretty trees, but they're almost Bob Ross trees. The leaves are going away. Wow, 10 days until Halloween. But we got the pumpkins carved, we made pumpkin seeds, and we've got Phoenix's costume. Uh, he's gonna be here for Halloween this year, so that's really cool. Not saying a word. Not talking about the trees at all. Nope, not gonna say a single word about the trees. <laughs> when you absolutely have to move your house, there you go. <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. That's the whole house. Wow. Awesome. Don't see that every day. Headed out to get some parts, and then I'm headed to my job for the day, which is awesome. And it's supposed to sprinkle and or rain today, but my job is in a garage. Love it. This morning... Phoenix asked me about his pictures, and I'm like, oh my gosh. Yesterday, I totally spaced um, putting Phoenix's pictures into the vlog for the montage. So, he does have some pictures today, and I will run those right now while I'm thinking of it. There's just a few. what happens when you follow too close at least it looks like oh never mind oh never mind never mind never mind look to me like the semis uh, like we're off the road and stuff like that because of a uh, accident but there's no accident so that's a good thing good thing it's better to break down because of mechanical problems than it is to have an accident I mean I'm sure that post it on the comments give them the choice would you rather have an accident or would you rather just break down? And I'm not talking about mentally breaking down. Or, you know, maybe I am. I don't know. I guess I could, that's a breakdown too. Okay, there we go. Let's do this. Would you rather have a car accident, have your car break down, or have a mental breakdown? You have to choose one. <laughs> Middle of the afternoon, making it home. Got to get home, unload the truck, organize stuff, scrap metal, do some business paperwork. Let's see what else the day brings. Well, the rainy weather is back. It is that time of the year again. 10 days until Halloween too. That's hard to believe. That's really hard to believe. And I'm hungry. That's not so hard to believe. So we're done with the laborers part of the work day. Awesome. Basically, well, get ready for tomorrow. That's the important part. Get ready for tomorrow and then relax for the rest of the night. And then edit. In that order. Sounds like tiny little hail balls on the window. Watch, watch. When we get up to this, or listen, listen. When we get up to this bridge, this overpass, when we go under it, listen to the difference. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Listen. Look at the difference. See? Doesn't it sound like little tiny hail balls hitting the window? Well, it's been a short one today, and we're going to continue that so that I can go to bed. I know. It's that time. Just so that you guys don't say, hey, there's no Buffy in the vlog. There's the Buffy in the vlog right there. Same as... She hasn't moved from last night, actually. She's been there for the last 24 hours. Buffy. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to startle you. I just wanted you to see... Or people to see that you're like, okay. Good girl. Good girl. Do you like the pumpkin seeds? Hmm? 
there's a couple of burnt pumpkin seeds, and um, she's been enjoying them because I don't want to eat them. Okay, so, excuse me, here we go. Excuse me again, wow. You were not invited up, you were hairy, and your breath stinks. You need a Tic Tac. This is the happy birthday mom vlog, and I will say, and I know that she she's already said it to me to make sure to tell you guys uh, thank you for the birthday wishes. Um, they're also amazing. You guys are rock. Um, there's a comment I really want to get to because I'm ex excited about it, but oh, and this is mom. <laughs> so hold that thought. And we're back. Didn't seem like any time went by, but uh, mom's doing good. Um, I called earlier to wish her a happy birthday on her actual birthday, um, but uh, she uh, wishes you, or says that she thanks all of you guys for your birthday wishes. But there are a couple comments I'd like to read. Tony Fredrickson, happy birthday, Pat. I'm sorry, dude, I have to. Pygmy candy corn, L-M-F-A-O. Seriously love watching you every day. The word for, uh, the word for today is albino. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking of. Uh, Nicole Flynn, that's not fair. I want Krispy Kreme donuts. We don't have a Krispy Kreme donuts here in Reno. That's why my mom wanted Krispy Kreme donuts is because we have one here in Tacoma, but they don't have one uh, close to where they live. Branson Haunted Hills, aw, happy, happy belated birthday to your mom. I hope her knee is healing good. It is. In fact, um, she's doing remarkably well. Uh, so that that's really good. Uh, and another YouTuber that I watch is going to sell her home and property, and it's located in East Seattle. Let me know if you want the info, and I will get it for you. No thanks. <laughs> I don't make enough hardly to live where I live, much less live in Seattle. It is expensive to live there. It's crazy. You couldn't pay me enough to live in Seattle. Also, too congested, too many people. But thank you anyway. Uh, and then the final comment for the Happy Birthday Mom vlog. Marie Winton. This is totally off topic. But I have a fun idea. I wanted to see if you want to be a part of. As you know, I'm getting ready to go on a road trip, a road trip after Halloween through Oregon, Idaho, and Utah. One of the places I'm planning to see is Monument Valley. Monument Valley is where they filmed the part of Forrest Gump, the scenes where he stops running. I was wondering, since you do an awesome Forrest Gump impression, would you be willing to say the line Forrest says in that scene and let me use it in the vlog I'll be filming there? I will, of course, give you credit and link to your channel and all that good stuff. I believe the line is, I'm pretty tired. I think I'll go home now. Yeah, I'd be, like, totally happy. I, dude, yeah. <sighs> Just uh, tell me what medium you would like it on. And I'm also thinking that when Phoenix and I go uh, trick-or-treating this year, the only costume that's, like, really easy to do, although I'd have to shave, which it grows back, so I'm not worried about it, um, is I'm thinking about bringing Forrest Gump out. So I could be Forrest Gump for Halloween. I could get lots of candy. Maybe even one or two Dr. Peppers. That's all I have to say about that. On with the next vlog. A few select comments. Crystal S, I sent you a card and hope you got it. Hope you like it. I'll be looking for it. Tony Fredrickson, you guys right here? Check. Oh my Phoenix, yes we are. He was such a big love bug this weekend. Yeah, that's my boy. The one and only Lindsey Bird. Card went out to you today. You can open it when you get it. Thank you. I will. Uh, Nicole Flynn, and I'll be looking for it too. Nicole Flynn, good afternoon. I'm sorry I'm so late uh, watching the vlog today. I had a bad night last night with my nerve pain. You didn't sleep hardly. I'm sorry about your nerve pain. But how did you know I didn't sleep good last night? I really want to know. I know. It was a typo, but... Uh, I tried to make it funny, dang it. Um, I'm really glad you like your Halloween card I sent. I know you don't like glitter, but I thought that the design of the card was just too cool to pass up. It really was. It was a really nice card. And I love the Phoenix and Dad videos. The jack-o'-lanterns turned out really awesome. Halloween fur. Phoenix, your jack-o'-lantern turned out awesome. Good job. So did yours, Troy. Thank you. Emerald Gypsy Art, whatever happened to your fancy pumpkin carving knives thing you've got? Oh, you mean like the ones that I used yesterday? Phoenix used the other ones. He, he used the cheap ones that if they break, I don't care, but I, I use the good stuff. Right now, she is giving herself a mani-pedi. Good girl. Okay, I don't know what I was saying. Uh, Mr. Brot. Well, Troy, Angie did say on day 3267 in COC that she was looking forward to seeing the card, so talk it over with her and let her decide. Oh, I'll, I'll open it when she gets here. 
Uh, I'm just glad that it made there in one piece. A little teaser. There's more in the envelope than just a card. Ooh. Interesting. I'm so excited. And the final comment, uh, Carrie Ann Olson, I like how Phoenix just picks up the camera. You know, I do too. In fact, I went into the kitchen and was like, dude, where's the camera at? And I, I had to look in the other room. It's like, oh, he's got the camera. It was so cute. So maybe, maybe we'll look into getting him another camera. Maybe one that doesn't have an adjustable lens on it. So that, that that's one thing that can't break on it. But anyway, well, we'll see what happens. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Happy haunting. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. I know I say it, and you guys are like, comment, rate, subscribe. Okay, whatever. You know, you hear me say it all the time. Well, do it. <laughs> Just kidding. No, I'm not. See you guys tomorrow. Bye.